me today, and it's always an honor to be in front of the board. Um, things are going very well, just uh, you know, give you economic conditions at Steda. Uh, we've uh, this past year we've seen some good stability. We're expanding into other markets, like I've mentioned uh, before the uh, commencement of the meeting. We're moving into medical manufacturing. Um, because we do have the most advanced manufacturing capabilities here in Valdosta. Furthermore, uh, we're starting to supply uh, General Motors with performance parts, the GM performance brand as well. We opened up another company here in Valdosta called LSR Performance. So we are growing. And, you know, I was telling Alan, you know, this morning, I said, you know, we're all going to be looking back at this day, but I plan to have a couple of hundred employees here in the next five years. Okay, because we do see economic change in our industry. And one thing, being the leader in Ford Performance, especially with the Mustang, and this is sort of confidential, we don't want to put this actually in the press, but the you might want to hold it. So. <laughs> <laughs> Can we? You're in a public meeting. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. It's all positive for, for okay. everyone, but right. I, I, it's, it's basically general knowledge. But the Mustang is uh, going global, okay? And next week, in two weeks, we're going to have the Chinese government here in Valdosta because they want to leverage the Steda name in China because China is very pro-American. And what they want to sign a licensing agreement with, with, with Steda to promote the Steda brand in China. And that's everything from our automotive components to our clothing wear to everything that will be coming you know, out of distribution here out of, out of Valdosta. So we see a lot of good things coming, and I hope uh, when the uh, it's Simone, Simona Industries that's coming, flying in from China uh, in about two weeks, and we're going to have our round table and meeting here. I'd like maybe possibly a few people from the board to come out and meet them. And then from here we go to Detroit, Michigan, because we're going to be le leveraging the distribution of Mustangs in China. Because China's economy, as we all know, has grown, and Valdosta has given us the opportunity to be competitive in a world market to create more jobs, which we are going to see, like I said, at Allen, in the next year or two, we're going to be really starting to, to flourish. So that's a, a quick insight of what's going on with Steda. Um, you know, we're hiring people out of the Wireglass, Wire, Wiregrass Technology Center, which is good. We have one of your uh, professors there that works part-time at Steda as well, and we're teaching them the automotive industry the high-tech level. Um, and uh, so everything's going good. We have really good talent. And something what else is really exciting, we're already starting the process, is we're starting to do lights out technology. People go, well, what's lights out technology? Is it a covert operation? <laughs> Not really. What we're doing is um, we're already starting it now is we're running the machines the first eight-hour shift and then when the, when, the, when the operators go home, the machines continue to run another three to four hours. So when we start building up, you know, our, you know, the demand for different products in the medical, we're going to start, you know, trying to run on a 24-hour cycle in the future. So everything's looking great. Again, uh, we're proud to be here, and we do appreciate the support of the Industrial Authority and the community here in Valdosta. Thank you. All right. So next year.